My name is David Banner. Sucks, sex, drugs, and video games, and two in one, baby. Let's go. And you are logged in to Hip Hop Wired. Wait, I want to finish. Dot com. <laughs> and you are logged in to Hip Hop Wired. Dot com. Well, the, the title is Sex, Drugs, and Video Games. Um, it's actually like a, th uh, uh, it's a three part section. It's a, it's a question that I'm asking people. Um, when I went to um, Europe, when Get Like Me was at it's the thunderstorm that it was, I got an opportunity to see how the world viewed African American males. And um, I was embarrassed. I really, that was one of the reasons why I took that break for a minute. Because I really tried to figure out like, you know, what could I do to better that process? You know, because honestly, I'm not going to sit up here live and bother my spirit. So, you know, that's when I decided to do the record that I fully, find, well, that we fully financed with Ninth Wonder, you know what I'm saying, Death of a Pop Star. So that took care of the artistic side of me, you know what I'm saying? Cause that was one of the dopest albums, period. So then it came back to, now I have to service the conventional David Banner fan. Like, how can I, how can I, how can I do that and serve my fans? You know, because we gotta be honest, the people that put me on, was folks that like, like a pimp. Why in most cases, we not comfortable unless somebody is downgrading us or calling us a nigga or a bitch? Why is it that we from the hood and we see all these hood situations like, we don't need to hear that too. We can go right outside and see it. So why is it that we want to be trapped in this world that nine times out of 10, if you really step away from it, we don't want to be in. So then the second part of sex, drugs, and video games is now asking the world, if, a, if, if black people, the only stimulus that we get is sex, drugs, and violence. Like you can give us three different cups, but if they all got water in them, do you really have a choice? If every time we see a movie, a black man is a dope dealer for the most for the most part. He's violent or or has something dark about him in the sense of what they say darkness is. Um, if that's the only stimuli that you feed them, then what kind of music you think you gonna get, huh? You know what I'm saying? And then the last part that I'm asking people is that, you know, as much as you think you're making a choice, if people are only feeding us that. If you give, if, if you grow up a kid, you grow up and you see a kid, you tell a kid, he a king, he a king, he a king, he a king, all his life, what you think he gonna be when he grow up? But if you constantly tell the kid every day of his life, he a nigga, he ain't gonna never be shit, he ain't gonna grow up to be nothing, what do you think is he gonna, he's gonna be? So at the end of the day, I'm asking people, if life is really a video game, then who has the controller? That's what sex, drugs, and video games is.